Uh, Abdullah again from uh, UK. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu uh, Sheikh, uh, my uh, second question, I need to add something as well. Okay. Is that two brothers are sitting, let's say, example, two brothers are sitting in the masjid, and I go to the first brother on the right, I give him the salam. He replies me. And I give the second brother on the left, Assalamu alaikum. He extends his hand, says the sal- wa alaikum salam, but he does not look at me. He's looking at the brother because he's on a conversation. He just says wa alaikum salam and he continues talking. So he does not look at me. This is my question. Is that, uh, because I found it a bit uh, odd and rude, like why does he not looking at me? He just gives the salam, replies to the salam, extends his hand, but does not look at me. Okay. So I, I asked the question, why did you do this? So I wanted to clarify on this. Okay. Um, Brother Abdullah's question is clear. So he goes to the masjid. He gives salam to the first person. Assalamu alaikum. The guy replies, wa alaikum salam. He gives salam to the second person who does not look at him. So yes, he shakes hands, wa alaikum salam. And he's looking elsewhere. So Brother Abdullah is saying that this is rude. And I agree with you. This is rude, but it is not prohibited. And... Akhi, we have to be always, uh, um, not apologetic, but we have to always care for others. I don't know what the brother has in his mind, what problems are burdening his shoulders. I don't know if he is having a fight with his wife or his child is in the hospital or he is overburdened with debt or any other reason. So I always give brothers an excuse. I pardon them. So as long as he replied to my salam verbally and he shook my hands, even if he did not look at me, so what? People usually, Abdullah, would take positions against those who interrogate and question and make them feel uneasy. So when someone says, Sheikh, I spoke to you that day and you were not very happy speaking to me. Sheikh, I was talking to you and you were answering someone else. People who interrogate me and keep on asking me questions like this, I would rather stay away. You don't want this. You'd like to be the kind of person that everyone loves you. Everyone cares for you. Everyone loves to sit and talk to you. But if you put People under pressure. Why didn't you look at me when I said salam? Why was your hand so soft and not a tight grip? Maybe you don't want to shake hands with me. Maybe you are racist. You think that I am from this uh, um, ethnicity or that, and you think low of me or you look down at. Come on. I have like a gazillion people I can be friend with, and you're making this trouble for me? Please. Keep your distance and stay away from me. So we don't want to reach that limit. And may Allah Azza wa Jal expand our hearts to our Muslim brothers and sisters. Uh, this is all the time we have until we meet next time. I leave you fi amanillah. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.